Hello children, today we are going to practice addition with carryover. In the previous class, we have already discussed about addition, but that time we practice addition without carryover. And in today's class, we are going to practice addition with addition with carryover. Okay. Now let us solve these examples. And first of all, you have to write the unit, okay? This one, T, O. O is for ones and T is for tens. These are units, okay? And here, 7 and 5 is in ones place and 2 and 5 is in tens place. And remember children, first you have to add the digit of ones place. So which are the numbers in ones place? 7 and 5 no so you have to add 7 and 5 first okay so now let's add 7 and 5 7 plus 5 is equals to 12 no 7 and 5 is equals to 12 in 12 2 is in ones place and 1 is in tens place so let's write 2 is in ones place okay let's write this 2 is in ones place and 1 is in tens place so we carry forward this in tens place here okay this one will carry forward in tens place okay so now let's add the number in tens place so which are the numbers in tens place 1 2 and 5 so let's let's add these numbers 1 plus 2 is 3 and 3 plus 5 is 8 no so 82 is the answer 27 plus 55 is equals to 82 okay now let's try another example here this tens and ones it's a unit okay you have to write this unit and here also which are the numbers in ones place 2 and 8 and numbers in tens place 4 and 1 and we know that we have to add the numbers of ones place first okay so let's add 2 plus 8 so 2 plus 8 is equals to 10 okay here 0 is in ones place and 1 is in tens place so let's write 0 in ones place and 1 is carry forward in tens place okay here tens place we have to carry this one in tens place okay so let's add the number numbers of tens place so which are the numbers of tens place? 1, 4 and 1. So let's add this number. 1 plus 4 is 5 and 5 plus 1 is 6. Okay. So 60 is the correct answer. And 42 plus 18 is equals to 60. Okay. This way you have to do addition with carryover. Thank you.